I've known Dick Hubert since he was middle-aged and I was a young man. We've really enjoyed each other, or at least I've enjoyed him, because he takes work so seriously, but not himself so seriously. He is the heart and soul of the department in the sense that all of us, you know, every day when we write our name and we put, you know, Hubert Department of Global Health, or in my case, a Hubert Professor, you feel a, a, a very a unique uh, connection to him, to his foundation, and to his family. The students aspire to attend there because of the hands-on research, the work with CDC, the work with CARE, and it, without um, Dick's uh, contribution, his generosity, this would not be possible. Dick Hubert and the Hubert Foundation have transformed global health at Emory. It began in 1997 when he supported 25 graduate students overseas to work on projects. Global Health came to me by virtue of the fact that a family foundation was established by our family, particularly my mother and father, to do um, work in the global area for uh, people who were starving, hungry, famished, much of what he has done probably comes from the Good Samaritan story of not passing by someone in need. But when you hear the Good Samaritan story and people always end up, who is your neighbor? It ends up that the answer is people of a different religion or of a different country or of a different culture. But the Hubert family took this the next step, which was, and it's correct, that their neighbors really are all of the people who will ever be born in the future. The Hubert Department of Global Health now is recognized as one of the premiers, if not the premier department of global health in the United States among academic institutions. And this is in great part uh, because of the support that the Hubert Foundation gave to the department. If you take Christian values in, in, into account at all, they are to heal the sick and feed the hungry and starving. My mission statement was not restricted to any group or specific kind of people. The work has been transformative at Emory and transformative throughout the world. Dick is truly a global citizen. When we went to North Korea is when we best discovered that we could, in our little niche, do a lot of good. At the beginning, we, we engaged in uh, agricultural projects to undertake farming and to overcome the loss that they suffered from just either the weather or, or uh, overpopulation or the lack of uh, technical skill. Mr. Hubert and his family and his trust fund have been the biggest contributors to global health at Emory. This has provided support for students, but it's provided support for faculty. And it's very important to have faculty become mentors for these students. That's the way you pass on civilization, is through mentors. From the very beginning, it was evident that Dick Hubert was a man who uh, believed in the humanity of everyone believe that all people could contribute and would contribute if they were given the opportunity. Dick's most important contribution is the global health area that he has changed the landscape at Emory. What Emory has provided for me, I couldn't find anywhere else I don't believe in the world, and that is the resources and ability and commitment of other people with the same goals consistent with our mission statement.